Hello, this is Brian from Food for Peppers. Uh, today I'm going to make a bracelet uh, from two pieces of cabinet grade uh, plywood that have been glued together with tight bond. You can see I've uh, just glued them together and uh, left them overnight. Uh, I found the center and uh, took a compass and drew a circle so I can take it to the bandsaw and cut the corners off, dr uh, drill a two and a half inch hole through the center, and then I'll chuck it up and uh, get started with the turning process. Okay, I'm back from the bandsaw in the drill press, two and a half inch hole in the center, cut the corners off. Uh, as you can see, uh, when it turns, it'll have a nice uh, color on it. Uh, you don't see a lot of gaps like you do with uh, the lower grade plywood. That's why I wanted to go with cabinet grade. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and chuck this up. And I would say don't overly tighten it. Just tighten it snug where it's not going to move because if you put too much pressure on it, you'll... Uh, you'll break the uh, the blank. Okay, today I'm going to use, uh, you can see the starter um, set of um, um, easy wood tools. I'm just doing the square and, uh, and the round one and uh, we'll see how those do today. Protect me on the back side so I gotta be very careful I don't hit my tool into the into the chuck. Okay, since uh since I drilled a two and a half inch hole and that's the finished diameter, um I'm not going to have to take any off the inside. I'm just going to be able to sand that. If you want a, a little bigger for a, a lady's uh, larger wrist, uh, I would just take a little bit off the inside, flip it over, and uh, take a little bit and even it out and sand it. You could always go with a, a little bit larger drill bit if you wanted to. I'm going to go ahead and flip it over now. Okay. Even up the other side.
toughest trick now is uh, trying to get them get each side and get it symmetrical. You don't have to. You can have it uh, a little different, give it a little unique uh, uniqueness. Okay. Trying to get some of the bulk now so it's not quite as heavy, but the plywood will tend to be a little a little lighter than a hardwood or even a, well, basically a hardwood. Not a lot of bulk here to have on a, a lady's wrist. Well, take it off and show you what it looks like. It looks pretty symmetrical. I can see there's some, uh, I guess some breakout here on the edge where it gets thin. I think I can take care of that with uh, sandpaper. If not, I can uh, go in here and touch it up just a little bit. You know, much better. Then uh, now it's just a matter of taking uh, sandpaper and uh, finishing up. So it's a real simple project, quick and easy. Uh, then take, uh, I always like uh, the spray on um, oil based polyurethane. I just buy little cans of uh, min, uh, Minwax and um, spray it four or five times and it's, uh, it's ready, for, uh, ready for my wife to wear.